Hi all, welcome to the best of CAT series by IMS. I am Parmeshwar over here. So kindly solve the particular problem and then resume the video. So in this particular sum, it is on the concept of sequence in series. It is saying that if T1, T2 and so on up to let's say Tn are the real numbers such that T1 plus T2 up to Tn happens to be nothing but 2n square plus 9n plus 13 for every positive integer which is more than equals to 2 and they have given T of k equals to a 1 or 3 and the objective is to find out the value of k over here. Now what we can understand is if I look at T1 plus T2 up to let's say T of n it's nothing but equal to a s of n. So sum of the n term which is T1 plus T2 up to a Tn which is given to us as 2n square plus a 9n plus 13. Now if I can find out the nth term over here and if I equate that Tn to be equals to a 1 0 3 over here we can easily find out that value of n. So what I can do is if I need to find out T of n I hope people understand this that T of n is nothing but equals to a s of n minus s of n minus 1. Now what does that mean if I say s of n minus 1 this simply means some of the first n minus 1 terms which is t1 plus t2 all the way up to t of n minus 1. And how will I find s of n minus 1 if I know s of n I can simply replace n as n minus 1 and if I do so what will I get I will get nothing but 2 times of n minus 1 whole square plus 9 times of n minus 1 plus 13. And if you can see over here that my term t1, t2 all the way up to t of n minus 1 are common in both the series. So if I now subtract, they will get cancelled out. So we get tn which is going to be equals to nothing but 2 times of n square minus n minus 1 whole square plus 9 common. I will get n minus n minus 1 and 13 minus 13 becomes 0. So if I simplify this slightly, what do I get? 2 times of n square minus n square plus a 2n minus 1 plus a 9. Because if I look at the bracketed term, I will get n minus n plus 1 become nothing but 1 in the bracket. Hence, I get 9 times of 1 over here. So what do I get finally? I get nothing but 4n minus 2 plus 9 becomes a 7. So what I know is that my t of n happens to be a 4n plus 7. So the term tk will be equals to a 4k plus 7 and they have given that t of k happens to be a 1 not 3. So if I equate the term 4k plus 3 as 1 not 3, I will get the term 4k to be equals to a 96 and my value of k will become equals to a 24. So my answer for this particular question must be a 24, a straightforward problem. Now if you have understood the concept over here, kindly solve the replica question and put your answer in the comment section.